The following tutorial is brought to you by the University at Buffalo Libraries Access Services. This tutorial contains both video and audio. This tutorial illustrates how to create a simple budget in Microsoft Excel using various functions and formatting options. Today we will be turning this blank spreadsheet into a budget that will do the math for you. First we will put a header on our budget. Select cell A1 and double click. A blinking line will appear indicating that you may now enter text. A basic budget will have two columns, one to identify the expense or income and one to list the amount. For this example, column A will identify the expense or income and column B will list the amount. It is recommended to leave an empty row between your header and data, so select cell A3 and type in the first title. To resize the cell to fit your text, place the cursor on the line between columns A and B in the top row and hold down the left mouse button while you drag it to the desired spot. By resizing the cell, we prevent the text and numbers from columns A and B from overlapping. Select cell B3. Insert the starting amount here. Don't worry that it does not show in currency, we will fix that later. Continue to list text in column A and figures in column B until all data is entered. Now, to have Excel add all the numbers together for you, select cell B6 and then select the FX button next to the text bar. This will allow you to insert pre-programmed mathematical functions into the selected cell. For this example, we will select SUM. Excel will now give you the option to define the parameters of the equation. The default is to apply the function to all contiguous cells, in this case cells B3 through B5. We can change that if we wish by manually typing in the cells we wish to select. However, in this case the default is what we want, so click OK. The sum will now appear in the cell selected. To format your cells to show they are currency, highlight all the cells you wish to alter by starting at the top and holding down the right mouse button and dragging to your stopping point. Then release the button and only the highlighted cells will be affected by the next step. Right-click on the highlighted cells and select Format Cells from the menu that appears. This will provide a variety of options with which you can alter the appearance of your budget. To turn the numbers into currency figures, select the Number tab and then Currency from the side menu. You can then select the number of decimal points to show after the number and the type of currency you wish the figures to be identified as. For our example, choose two decimal points and the American dollar and click OK. The highlighted cells are now formatted as currency. If you wish to color code your figures, you may go through the same formatting process and this time select the Font tab for options on color, size, and style of type. Thus ends our tutorial on creating simple budgets in Excel. In this tutorial, you learn the basics of budget drafting in Microsoft Excel. Thank you for watching. To request another video tutorial, please contact us by phone at 716-829-5742 or email at hsl.com. I-L-L -L at buffalo.edu.